Alright. Okie dokie, let's take a look around. <clears throat> there seems to be a bunch of little thingies. Uh, he's got his stuff up. Great! Nope. Ah, Gail. That's why I put you there. Oof. Some healing for a wizard in need. <laughs> nope. Okay. All right. Seriously though. That's right. Please, Mistra. Can't afford to let up. Yeah, one second. Let's have some fun. There we go. <coughs> oh, right, whose turn is it? It's not him. Let's end this. Us. Yeah, it's her. Right, the warrior is still alive. Silence can't have spells, and this is why you have ranged attacks. <sighs> Alright. Okay, uh, let's just. This thing, and I do have my bow. That's why we have it. Critical. All right, that's fun. Always fun to miss. Jump. Gail's dead. Can't save him. Alright. Uh, well, I could run over and pick him up. I need to deal with these guys. So I can't really go anywhere else, huh? Flourish. This one. Can I actually dash? Can I actually hide? Let's find some prey. Got to keep fighting. Okay, I did that right. <clears throat> Alright, so there's a just dude behind me. So give you a little push. Go away. My luck again. Yeah, this is guys I'm scared of, but I'm scared of these guys. So we're 
I'm just gonna run with haste over here. <clears throat> Don't you hit my healer? That's my juice box. Get me in this little corner. The subtle approach. Right. What should I do? Alright, what we should do is hit this dude. Bonk him. Um, it's undead. I hit with my main hand weapon. Yeah. Give a little push. Ha ha ha, sucker. Blood comes easy these days. Uh, let's just step over here. <laughs> All right, get started. You. <clears throat> yeah, you had to get up all the way over there, huh? Oh, no, don't hit me. Hit my meat shields. Hit Gale. Gale's the real danger. Hmm. Make it hurt. <laughs> Sucker. Alright, let's see. Anyone in sight? This way. Run down here. Now just... oh, they see me. Can't give up. I can't see him, but I can. Hmm. Nope. Uh, let's not do that. Okay. Uh, nope. There it is. I don't want to run Got over here. Press on. Oh come on! That was that was perfect. Survival is all that matters. Oof! Little nuke right there. A little nuke just went off. What's going on, buddy? Well, so much for peace. There's blood in the air. There it goes. Alright. Gail's dead. Everything's fine with the world. Hey, you. This will be nicely. Not enough food. But Dash is cunning actually. That did nothing. Run. Alright. I'm ready. Let's move over here. Hmm, I don't remember. Ah. <sighs> I, I, I guess this railing blocks me. This little railing blocks me. 
What is this? What did I do? Alright. That's... That's bonk. That's so much bonk. Swift as my feet can carry me. Like, I can see over the railing. I can hold my hands over the railing. I should be able to shoot spells over the railing. Ahead. Well, well, well. It seems you made a tactical error. Down with you. They didn't want yeah. to surrender their valuables, even after death. Yeah. Whoa. Well met. I'm not I there. I am a magical projection of Gale of Waterdeep, and if you see this manifestation, that means I have prematurely perished. However, for reasons that cannot be disclosed, it is of vital importance that my death be remedied at your earliest convenience. Why? You may rest assured that I do not speak out of self-preservation alone. Many lives depend on my return to the living within the span of two days. Why? I trust I've made myself clear. That will be covered by the for reasons that cannot be disclosed clause. So let's move on. Why? I have upon my deceased person a magical item that can accomplish my return. But such is the value and rarity that it is protected by a multi-layered security protocol. I will now explain the protocol. Step one is to retrieve from my person a pouch I wear over my heart. Next, you must unthread the purple seam that seals it in a counterclockwise fashion. Do not touch any other colored strands. Inside the pouch, you will find a folded letter and a tiny flute. Unfold the letter and note the markings in the top and bottom corners. These are the notes you will need to play. Starting from the bottom right, play the notes in correct order, clockwise this time. Upon completion of the tune, a magma method will appear, which will pose the following question. Iskcha Chisnaga. This is ignorant for what is my name? The answer is Kasi Trak Ash. Pronounce the name correctly and the method will breathe on the letter. Stay clear because the little scamp can melt metal. Words will now appear on the letter's surface, effectively turning the letter into a scroll of true resurrection. Use it to bring me back to life. That's a lot. So it is. Our lives depend on it. Now, repeat my instructions back to me, please. In that case, this will be an easy exercise. Step one. Mm. Mm. And next. <clears throat> Purple. Right. You then have access to the letter and the flute. Go on. Uh, play notes. Bottom left corner? No, no, no. You start at the bottom right corner. Remember to play them clockwise. After that... Right corner. Uh, ash is the last word. Correct. But pay attention to the trap part. Ch is back of the throat. And so we have gone through the necessary steps again. Let's Purple, hope practice right makes perfect corner, in the ash. End. Best of luck with the protocol. May my cold, dead hands soon be refilled with the warmth the of life of so they can shake Roll yours in gratitude. Finish. Examine. Mm. Uh oh. Exit. Uh, 
Uh, oh, what is what is happening? All right. All right. Let's see. Uh, inventory. Dale's pouch. Open. The pouch is sealed with differently colored strands of thread. Purple thread in counterclockwise fashion. As the purple thread becomes undone, the pouch opens to reveal a letter and flute inside. This is the flute Gale kept on his person. Uh, A faint right. magical aura envelops its wooden surface. The flute awaits with bated breath. Oh, poo. Ah, uh, shit. See, it couldn't have just said do it that the counterclockwise fashion. A, B, C, D. I don't know. Uh oh. This is in clockwise fashion. So, if it goes A, B, ah, I should have. That wasn't the right note. You'll have to start anew. Oh, so I did the right the first time. Bring it this way. Try and make a dragon put lips together to blow. We want to blow poison. That wasn't the right note. You'll have to start anew. This is gonna, I, I didn't read the note. Alright, so it's not A, that one, so that means... That wasn't the right <coughs> note. You'll have to start anew. Nope, it won't let me go back. Alright, so... D. Should have read the letter. Oh. I could go back in my recording. D is correct. <clears throat> oh. Oh. Huh? Wasn't the right note. You'll have to start anew. Okay. Is there? Uh, yeah, that's all. All right, all right, I have to read this fucking letter. All right, read. Arrow, ba ba ba. In the top left corner is A. Top right corner is a D. In the bottom right corner is a D. In the bottom left corner is an E. And we're doing it in the clockwise fashion. So that means in clockwise fashion, from right to right to left left so wait clockwise fashion we're spelling dead that little bitch we're spelling dead <clears throat> Gail's magic flute is ready to be played the flute awaits with bated breath D E. 
Okay. D. Sup, big nose. Iskcha Tisnaga. Ash. Daya Zoom. Mulfamesk. Dinu Franza Manfragel. All right, and now we use a revivify spell on him. To cure you, I cannot die. Please help me. And revivify on you. To cure you, me, damn you. No, nope, I don't want to talk to you. You bothered me. Right, I need to loot stuff now. Proper looting. I see you, room. <laughs> it's all mine. A lot of effort to hide one sarcophagus. Ooh, this. Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. I want to loot your stuff, guardian of tombs. Come on. Oh, come on. Got nothing in these pots? Oh, there we go. Ooh. Ooh. Let's see, where's my where's my magic? There we go. Now I gotta speak with dead people. Yeah boy. Ugh, my Gail's underwear. Alright. Let's see what's inside this. I hope it's a lot of gold. Well, that's handy. It has an odd back opening system. Cool. Hmm. An undead, you say? Who could have predicted that? Hello, Mr. Man. Will you be my friend? Please be my friend, you look dangerous. So he has spoken, and so thou standest before me. Right, as always. What a curious way to awaken. Now, I have a question for thee. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? Curiosity. Nothing more. Wilt thou answer my question? So, I ask again, what is the worth of a single mortal life? Hmm. Oh, 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 oh. That's currency. This fits me. Uh, to some, it is the only very well. I 
I'm satisfied. We have met, and I know thy face. That are, are we will see on to me? each other again at the proper time and place. You are coming on to me, you saucy man. Farewell.